Hi everyone, welcome to Nova Does Cosplay. I'm Nova, hi. And I'm going to show you how I made this miraculous ladybug costume from start to finish. Now I did buy the bodysuit, but I had to have some serious alterations done to it. But this video does include the wig styling, the mask making, the altering of the costume. So I hope you like the video and let's cosplay. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. And now that the holidays are done and the new year's begun, it's a bright new year, it means we are coming up on KatsuCon. So I got to thinking about what I wanna make for KatsuCon and I decided on this. Now what is this? Uh, well, I ordered it off of Wish and it came in with all the Christmas presents and got opened with Christmas presents, but it is a miraculous ladybug costume and um, I'm excited because I get to alter this for Katsukon, uh, but I wanted to show you what all I got. It has this beautiful flimsy mask, which I'm going to upgrade, obviously. It came with this uh, belt, which looks pretty cool. It's just a little pouch, doesn't do much of anything. And then the actual costume itself. Ta-da! Now, I'm just gonna go with, it's a little big for me. I don't know what size I ordered. This was a beautiful drunken purchase. Yay. And then it sat for a couple of weeks while we got through the holidays, so. Um, but this one's actually really good uh, in quality. I'm, I'm really liking it. It's got gloves this time, like actual little gloves. And as far as the zipper goes, it's an invisible zipper, works really well. I'm actually really excited to alter this one, but before I alter it, we're gonna go ahead and put it on, get like a test run, see how it looks, and then we'll get to the altering. I'm an enigma. Okay, first of all, I am now perfect. Nobody will ever know what my real identity is. I am hidden. And my cats are hungry. Do you have to eat right now? Well, uh, so mask aside, uh, the costume is a, a little big. Uh, you'll see what I mean when I go to the full body mirror here in a minute. But um, it's really comfy. Uh, it's not too hot. It's not too cold. All you need is a light jacket. No, it's it's a uh, it's pretty. Pretty comfortable, breathes pretty well, fits really good on my legs, actually. It's this whole upper body loosey-goosey thing that uh, isn't working quite well. Um, but I, I gotta say, I love how the, the conveniently placed sensor rings, I did have to cut out a finger so I could use my phone, but the conveniently placed sensor rings are, are very nice. I mean, polka dots. My God. Oh my god, I'm a dork. I'm sorry. Anyways, so let's go take a look at this in the full body mirror. So here's what it looks like in the full body. The pouch is, is still cute. I could take this in and like if I took it in a little bit, it would work well. But this is what's really kind of, look at that lovely little flap. It is nowhere near where my crotch is. It's just kind of there. So we're going to need to fix that. Obviously, the arms are super baggy. Like, look at all this. That's gonna need to be fixed. But the fit across the chest is nice. The fit across the waist is nice. It's this part in the arms that I think are definitely gonna need to be taken in, which is what we are going to be doing in today's video. Yes! So this is gonna be fun. But the beforehand squat test, as you can see, it absolutely does the squat test. Let me just suck this little bit in here. But it absolutely does the squat test. Oh, almost lost my balance there. But uh, yeah, it does I'll look another conveniently placed polka dot. These are some pretty conveniently placed polka dots if I do say so myself. Anyway, so let's get to altering and see how we can make this already pretty good bodysuit even better. Okay, the first thing we're gonna wanna do is flip this sucker inside out so that we can pin it to our body. 
Taking in a bodysuit is something I've done multiple times and my method of doing it is to put it on inside out, then to take my pin cushion and then pin together all the seams that I wanna take in. Uh, this is actually a sped up video. I'm just incredibly slow at this process. Just like with the lower body seams, we're gonna take our pins and we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna pin all the seams in the arms that we wanna take in as well. Next, we're gonna to go to our sewing machine and using the zigzag stitch, we are going to sew together all the spots that we wanna take in. Now it's time to start on my Miraculous Ladybug face mask. I do have a video for how I make my face masks, which I will link in the description below. And here she is, my finished Miraculous Ladybug uh, that you just saw me make. So we're going to kind of look at it in a little more detail so that you can see. Um, so here it is, in all its glory. As you can see, it fits significantly better, especially right here in this section. Now I can still do all the same squats and everything, so if we do the squat test, if you notice, the lovely conveniently placed dot is gone, so that's not there anymore. But we do have the conveniently placed, you know, trestle dots, so those are still fine. I can still move, I can still bend everything. It's actually a pretty decent little costume. So, came out really well. I hope that you found this tutorial to be helpful, this building of the costume to be helpful. If you wanna see more videos like this, let me know. Otherwise, I don't particularly care. I'm still gonna make more videos anyway. So, have a terrific day, and I will see you all at Katsukon.